the Evolve laser because I finally found a minimally invasive procedure that works. I primarily use the Evolve laser for prostate tissue. Uh, whenever there is obstructed prostate tissue, I try to get a nice open channel and relieve their prostate obstruction. I also use it for bladder neck contractures, uh, transurethral incision of prostate, bladder tumors, and the condyloma. When the patients typically come, I have them arrive to our office about approximately 30 minutes prior to the procedure, and uh, they will take two Darvaset tablets and one Valium tablet in the waiting room. They will then sit, assistants will then bring them back to the room, they will put, uh, have them undress, lay on the table, put 10 milliliters of lidocaine jelly into the penis, and wait 20 minutes. And at that point, we will put their legs in stirrups, I will take the cystoscope, look into the bladder, and inject uh, lidocaine right into the prostate, one on each side, five milliliters into each lobe, and uh, then I remove the needle and start doing the laser procedure. I start doing the laser procedure uh, by vaporizing the tissue on the lateral lobes until I get a good adequate result. I want to get a nice open channel and I keep taking the prostate down as far as I possibly can. I tend to mimic what I do in the operating room. After I've gotten a nice channel, I will then place a Foley catheter into the patient and leave that to a leg bag. The patient then walks out and is given two antibiotic pills. The patient then goes home uh, with a designated driver and then follows up with me in, a, in approximately two to three days for Foley removal. Uh, they took me right in and uh, started working on me. And I think I was in there about 30, 35 minutes. And I know they've done a good job because I could pretty well tell from listening and watching. There's very little risk associated with this procedure. The patients tolerate it very well. They have very little discomfort. Um, my vasectomy patients have more discomfort than these patients do. Actually, you have more pain when you go to the dentist to get a teeth fill, filled than you do with this procedure. I would recommend this rather than a hospital anytime. I love this laser. It is, it's a user friendly, it's patient friendly. The Evolve is better uh, in providing hemostasis and vaporization. This actually gets rid of prostate tissue. You vaporize prostate tissue and the results are very similar to a transurethral resection of the prostate which in theory then should last them a lifetime. I think that the enormous benefit of this is that there's an immediate improvement in symptoms because you're actually vaporizing and removing tissue. The other thing is that the procedure is done with no general or spinal anesthesia and they can be comfortable. The last one I was had a spinal, um, I, w I was awake of course but numb from the waist down. I was in the hospital I think five days and uh, catheter in all that time, blood running and then I was off work eight weeks and whenever I had to urinate, oh, it was just horrible. Because those terrible days where people would talk about all the pain and irritation and painful urination that they had are things of the past. And this was, I suffered no pain whatsoever. Once the uh, catheter was taken out, I was good to go. The Evolve laser has advantages. It's a different wavelength, so there are different characteristics that we take advantage of. The hospital is going to cost you more, and it's uh, longer time for you to recover on a hospital procedure than out of this one. Evolve is the future of urology. We are trying to move towards doing more and more procedures in an office. We are always looking at ways of doing procedures with the least amount of risk.